Um, hello and welcome back to Wedge and Gaming 360 on the gaming team. Today we'll be cooking a uh, speedy spaghetti carbonara. Um, you need uh, pasta, 300 pasta, spaghetti, um, 300 grams. Um, it says four bacon rashes, but you know, at the time we got uh, lardons, which are cut up bacon, you know, speed. Um, um, 250 grams of mushrooms. You know, cut up and peeled and, you know, all that stuff. Um, a garlic, cut up quite finely. Um, 250 grams of light soft cheese, which is your yeah, bat. Um, one egg, you've got two eggs there, but, you know, who's going to care? Um, 150 milliliters of skim milk. Uh, 30 grams of... Um, Cheese. Parmesan. Parmesan cheese. Uh, and two tablespoons of... Um, Fresh parsley, but we're using yes. Um, yes, basil. It says, it says parsley, but we're using, we're using basil. Yeah. Okay, you need to um, do um, the uh, uh, pasta spaghetti uh, thing in, um, in hot water and, you know, boil it for like 12-ish minutes. Uh, oh, spaghetti. Okay. Um, you need to put some oil in the uh, wok. Just like that, and, you know, you know uh, spread it out a bit. We're letting that heat up, and then we're going to add in the uh, bacon and mushrooms. Alright, now we're adding the, uh, the uh, bacon. Because it's heated up slightly. Yeah, and we need to push in the spaghetti. So it's not like always out. Um, just bend it over. And more bacon again. And the mushrooms. That's a lot of mushrooms. We've doubled the quantity on those because we've got this that is serving a lot of people, so all about the... So yeah, we've got a lot of people, you know, so... Yay, let's just double the quantities. Yeah. Uh, okay, the um, garlic goes in. Right, all of it, and mix it in. You know. Quite a lot, you want to get it all mixed through. So how long do we leave this on here? Um, when it's all sort of cooked, we've got because we've got quite a lot in here. We've got to um, just make sure it is all cooked, the bacon and the mushrooms. So normally it would be about five minutes, but it would probably take a little bit longer for us because we've got a lot in there. Yeah. Um, right now we're going to add our eggs, which are beaten together. But in your case, it will just be one egg. It's been beaten. Um, and then we add in the uh, cheese. Yep, in goes the cheese. Um, now we're going to uh, mix the uh, cheese and the eggs together. Right, um, so yeah, we're not done yet, but eventually it's just start looking like this. But like I said, we're not done yet. Right, now we are done. We um, add in our milk. Mm. Woo! Um, and roughly half the cheese. There we go. And... Oh, and you mix it all in. Quite nicely. It'd be quite liquidy, but you, that's good. You want it like this. Because, you know, food. Right, and now you add the uh, teaspoon of uh, basil or um, parsley, based on what you decided to use. And you mix that in as well. Just like everything else. And you keep on mixing it in. Okay, um, things seem to be going well. The bacon's cooking and the mushrooms are cooking and... 
it's reduced in size for some reason or another. Okay. Okay, we've uh, drained the uh, pasta and we're going to put it in there with the uh, rest of the things. You know, and mix it in. Hopefully better than I'm doing. And we're going to add the other mixture. Uh, yeah, in a minute we're about to add in the extra mixture that I was making, you know, just before. Right, um, in goes the mixture, and now we're just going to let it yeah, heat it all through and cook it. Like, you know, like it says on the recipe. It's like going to overflow if we put anything more in it. Luckily, there's nothing else to go in it. Yes. It was just in the nick of time moments. Um, we're pretty much done here, and we're about to put it in the uh, dish. Okay. For us, it's going in the, uh, in two dishes because of double quantity, but, you know, for a normal person, it would just be uh, one dish. Right, so here it is in the two dishes, looking great. Thanks for watching, please comment, like, and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you all soon.